third grade. Today we are going to mix a tone um, to paint the main body of our robot. Now we'll go back in and we'll put tints and shades to show a light source, but today we're just making a tone. So remember that a tone is any color mixed with gray, and in this case we're using blue today. So first you have to make your gray. So I have a big pile of white here. It's kind of hard to see in the video once I kind of put some black in it. Notice I didn't take a whole bunch of black. Black can be super powerful. So you want to do a little bit at a time. If it's not dark enough for you, you can add more until it's the tone that you want. So that's gray first. You're going to want a little bit extra white, very little black on your plate. So a big pile of white, very little um, black. And then you're going to mix it up by kind of stirring it and trying to keep it in one spot. You don't want to spread it all over the plate because then it will dry out before you get a chance to use it. So now I have gray. Now I'm going to take a bunch of my blue and mix it in. And this is going to make a tone of blue. Our robots are going to be different versions of um, blue, tints, tones, and shades of the color blue. When it is um, all mixed up and you like the color, then you're going to just start painting in your entire robot. You have a small brush. If you need a smaller one, there are some on the counter. If you use more than one brush, though, you are expected to wash more than one brush, swirling it in the palm of your hand using cold water. So you're going to do all the way around, being nice and careful. You'll get other accent colors on one of the last days of painting, so you can add in different colors for the buttons and things. But right now you are going through his whole entire body and adding that tone of blue. All right, at the end of class, this gets thrown away, this gets rinsed out, and this gets washed and put tips up in the cup. All right, thank you for listening. Wear a smock.